stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may now be seated. Good morning from WSFM. I'm Caitlin. And I'm Miss Fairbash. Did you know, today is Cinco de Mayo. Everyone knows that May 5th, or Cinco de Mayo, means tacos, fajitas, fun, and fiesta. This day celebrates the date of the Mexican Army's 1862 victory over France at the Battle of Puebla during the Franco-Mexican War. The day is also known as Battle of Puebla Day. While it is a relatively minor holiday in Mexico, in the United States, Cinco de Mayo has evolved into a commemoration of Mexican culture and heritage, particularly in areas with large Mexican-American populations. Attention French Club members, come join us for our last activity of the year on Friday, May 12th after school. Sign up in room 209 if you can attend. The next Spanish Club meeting will be next Friday, May 12th at 7 a.m. in room 105. To all National Honor Society members, our service day is tomorrow, May 6th. Please remember to bring all your donations and meet in Senora Miller's room by 7.50 a.m. The Manchester Book Club will be holding their end-of-year party on Wednesday, May 17th, in the library. It will start immediately at the end of school. All members are asked to bring food to share. Please see the Google Classroom to sign up. In addition to food, there will be games and we'll sign up for officers for next school year. All members can bring one guest. Next up will be Monica Clark with this week's Faculty Friday. Whatever happened to predictability? The milkman, the paper boy, evening TV. For Faculty Friday, we are recognizing, recognizing Mrs. Jacobson, Mrs. Christie, and Mr. Pekansky. Mrs. Jacobson has been teaching at Manchester for the past 19 years, and she's been teaching for a total of 21 years. She attended the University of Akron for her bachelor and master's degree in special education. She currently teaches Intervention Algebra 1, 2, and Geometry, and she co-teaches English with Mrs. Spear. However, she has also taught both history and science in the past. Mrs. Jacobson is the advisor for the freshman class, and her favorite thing about teaching at Manchester is the small community and that she gets to know all of the students, regardless of having them in class or not. Her advice for students would be to enjoy your time and be as active as possible. Her favorite memory from high school is scoring the winning goal against the Firestone girls soccer team her junior year of high school. Mrs. Christie has been at Manchester for her entire teaching career. Although her schedule changes every year, for the past 28 years she has been an inter intervention specialist in general biology, CP English 9, and United States history. She attended the University of Akron for her bachelor degree in special education and then attended Marygrove College for her master's in the art of teaching. Mrs. Christie spent 25 years as the advisor of student council and has coached JV softball at MHS. She also organizes the Minuteman program with Mrs. Miller and Mrs. Mobley, and she also organizes our annual Red Cross blood drives. Her favorite part about teaching at Manchester is the small community, and she is thankful to be a part of a district that is full of polite and well-behaved students. She also appreciates the support she gets from the community. Her advice for students is to get involved in extracurricular activities because you will make, it will make school more fun, and to choose friends that help you grow, not bring you down. Mr. Pekansky has been teaching for 25 years with 13 years at Manchester. He attended the University of Akron and the Ohio State University for his bachelor and master's degree. Mr. Pekansky is the junior and senior counselor for students at MHS and he's involved with the Panther Pack program for freshmen. He was involved in football, basketball, baseball, NHS, and student council during his time in high school and would continue his baseball career into college. His favorite part about teaching at Manchester is the tight-knit community and the support and that there are a lot of good kids here at Manchester. His advice for students is to never underestimate the importance of re reliability and hard work. He says that if you're willing to work, then good things will happen. His favorite memory from high school it was his ongoing sports rivalry, rivalry with Maslin High School and beating them in football. 
And now over to Ben with the sports. Good morning, Panther fans. Congratulations to the Manchester Middle School track team on setting four new height four new school records at their pack meet yesterday. Congratulations also to the boys for placing third. The varsity tennis team plays today at Marlington starting at 4.30. The varsity girls softball team plays today at home against Firestone. The JV girls team also plays today at CVCA, both with a start time of five. The varsity boys baseball team plays today at CVCA and the JV team plays at home against CVCA. Both games start at five. You can check the MHS Panther Sports Twitter account at Akron MHS Sports to get information on time changes, scores, play highlights, and more. Go Panthers! And now, back over to Caitlin and Miss Barabash. Thanks, Ben. Happy birthday today to Ella Thomas, and over the weekend, happy birthday to Marco Zuza. Today's lunch is Pizza Hut, Cheesy Broccoli, and Choice of Fruit. And Monday's breakfast will be whole grain mini chocolate do donuts, Choice of Fruit, juice, and milk. Thank you from WSFM. Signing off, I'm Caitlin. And I'm Miss Bearbash. Good luck on graduation tomorrow, Miss Bearbash, and everyone have a great day.